Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are back with NBA 2K24 Arcade Edition. And today I'm going to be showing you guys the easiest way to get free VC in this game. You know, VC playing the game through my career and just playing all the games manually is a super it's not hard but it takes a lot of time to do which a lot of people just don't have so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys a lot of easy ways to get vc and this method is really good really fast if you know what you're doing and you can get over a hundred thousand vc within an hour just by doing this one method alone so before we get into it make sure you guys smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you are new and comment down if this video helps you so first you are going to want to go over to your settings go over to manage roster and the team i use are the 76ers you're just going to want to make your starting five players 99 overall you want to go into their profile add a player you want to max out everything here if offense defense athleticism durability mental and x factor max out all that stuff that's all you're going to need to do for them you don't have to mess with their tendencies their signature moves their profile their biometrics none of that stuff so just make all the players 99 over everything and then once you do that go over to team rotation and take all the minutes off the bench and then go ahead and put every single minute on to your starters because you don't need any bench players you just need five players to be 99 over everything once you're done with that you're going to want to go over and save the roster so that you're able to load it up because you already have my thing loaded up as vc philly and the reason i use uh the 76ers it's a really simple reason that will show later so you're gonna go here you're gonna have to load the roster each time because for some reason when you load it and start up a new association like it resets the roster so I'm telling y'all, you're gonna want to do that and save it because if you have to make a 99 overall each time for five players, it's gonna take a minute, you know? In between getting VC and it's gonna make the method a lot slower. So you're gonna go over to the association, delete this one so I can create some space for a new one. See, before starting this, we have 81,279 VC. And sure, by the end, it'll be about 88,000. So we're gonna go next next turn all this to off go next see 76 is the first thing that pops up so you know it's just easy don't have to mess with anything over there put that on next and it'll load you into an association so once you're in here you're just gonna scroll all the way to the bottom simulate through and you don't have to mess with anything at all just disable cpu trades there and then you won't have to do anything until i think all-star voting it'll ask you if you want to see the all-star votes and if you want to cool but i assume you're not gonna want to because we are here for the vc and that's just gonna slow us down in between simulating so just press no through all of that and i'll see you guys at the end of the season all right boys we are almost done simulating just have a couple games left and you see right now we have 84,000 VC and we're gonna huge chunk once the season ends and boom there you go 88,404 VC that is about 7,000 VC just from simulating doesn't take more than five minutes I'll probably show y'all the time it took um simulating because I haven't actually timed it you'll see you go through the MVP rookie V all this stuff and you're just gonna click next you're not gonna go through the playoffs because the playoffs even if you win the finals it really doesn't give you vc and it's for me i find it a waste of time so here is where i would just save and quit and then i'll go back into my files load up the roster again and then i would create a new association and just go through all of that so as you see guys that is such a simple way to get vc and it's really easy and it's the most efficient way to get vc in this game so if you just do that for a little bit then you can easily just max out your mic uh career player and pretty simple you know so if you guys enjoyed this video if this helps you out make sure you smash that like button subscribe if you're new thinking about starting a my career um series and if you want that leave a comment see you next time but until then peace out